And I was like, dude, I love the idea of that. I want to help because I was also in a place of abundance by then. I had been working online for six months. I had a little bit of money coming in and I could step in and step into my passion, which I'm fully in now, you know, fully. It's fucking awesome. It's a good spot to be in, but it didn't start that way. Hell no. It started with money. Good. So yeah. th then what do you think of like greed? Because someone listening to this, they could say, you sound like a greedy fucking bastard. Someone that doesn't give a fuck about, you know, about other people or someone that doesn't give a fuck about this or that. You're just looking out for yourself. You know? Yeah. You I'd say fucking, I'd say get greedy. Okay. fast. Okay. <laughs> I'd say get fucking greedy because if you're not greedy, dude. But that's, you not gotta... like, that's not the popular opinion, right? I don't give a fuck if it's popular or not. You have to get greedy for yourself. Who's going to look out for you if you don't? Nobody. And by the way, we started this fucking conversation by saying, find a problem and solve it. That's how you make your money. So technically, if you're not solving people's problems that you could solve, you're not being greedy, you're withholding. And that's selfish. Yes. Selfish and greed are not the same. Right. If, you had, if you can find a way to solve a problem for people and they're willing to pay for it, and you don't provide the service, you are being selfish. Mm -hmm. If you go provide that service and charge a lot of money for it so that they get results, they change their life, that is being greedy for you, and that is being greedy for them. Mm -hmm. You're helping them be greedy by providing them a path forward. Now, they can step in, get greedy for themselves, focus on themselves, stay in their lane and fucking work hard, and get to a place where they're in the abundance. Now they can go find their passion, and step into this other realm of, of, of consciousness where you're living every life in the position you want to be in. It all comes back to some form of greed. If you're not being greedy, you need to fucking take a look in the mirror because nobody's going to do the work for you. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's like, like no one is coming to, 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 to help you and no. you can't, you can't pour out of an empty cup. You know, like you have to fill up your cup first and then what's overflowing, then you kind of pass that out there, right? Now, what you don't want to do is you don't want to just keep kind of accumulating everything for yourself. But then at the same time, if you look out for other people first before you look out for yourself, that's noble, but it's not sustainable. You're going to get to a point where it's like, well, fuck, everyone else is making money. Everyone else's lives are being impacted. Everyone else is, is this. Everyone else is that. You know, my life is the same, right? This is why, like, the whole, you know, the whole conversation of, like, people wanting to get out of a nine-to-five or get out of corporate. Like, a lot, a lot of our, you know, and, and I know you have these conversations a lot with a lot of our students, um, but, like, a huge chunk of our students come from the corporate world. I mean, I know you come from the corporate world. A lot of our executives come from the corporate world. And it's like... All the all the, the 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 cards are lined to benefit the company and the corporation, and then nothing really gets spread out. And I think that's where these big corporations kind of forget. It's like the reason why you got there is because you cared about other people at first, but then you get to a certain level where you, where you stop doing that, and everything kind of points directly at you. And then this is where people kind of feel like, okay, well, I'm helping other people. But I'm not being helped. And so this is why you got to kind of be greedy at first, help yourself, and then start helping other people, right? Yeah. Yeah, no, 100%. You can't pour out of an empty cup is like the saying of all sayings, right? Listening at home, like write that shit down, put it on your wall somewhere. You cannot pour out of an empty cup. If you don't fill your shit first, you have nothing to give.